Hi, and welcome to my 11th tutorial on HTML. This is a continuation of the last tutorial on internal links, how we link our web pages together. What we have done is made a folder called My Website and made two notepad documents with the HTML tags to create an index page and a page one. And with the tags, we have made them communicate with each other. This we have done with the relative links or paths instead of absolute links which we use in creating our external links. This works perfectly when our index page and page 2 reside in the same folder. But we also need to know how to link pages together when our web pages are not in the same folder. And as your website grows, there's a big chance that you will be making more folders to organize your web pages. So let's continue from where we left off and for those of you who haven't seen the last tutorial you can check it out on my web channel under HTML tutorials and it's number 10. So here is our my website folder and here we have page 1 and index as text files and page 1 and index as HTML files. And here we have uh, the tags needed to communicate to page one and here we have the tag needed to communicate to index and here we have our relative path or relative link and this is the link text and let's uh, just click on index to see that they work here we have the index page linking to page one page one linking to the index page it works. Now we can um, make a new folder and we call this folder for chess. It's just my example. Let's say you have a web page and you have a part of it which concerns chess. We'll put all the chess related stuff right into that folder. Now instead of making a new notepad document we are going to use page one again but this time in the title we are going to call it for page two and the text here this is page two we'll save it file save as and we are going to put this inside the chess folder we are going to call it for page two as a text document first and then we are going to save it again file save as page 2 is already here and this time page 2.html save now when we go into chess we have our page 2 here now we already have a link from our index page to page one and let's put a break tag behind it so it doesn't come on the same line and then we are going to make a link to our page two which is in the chess folder the a tag href attribute equals quotation mark and now we want the chess folder not the my website folder but the chess folder chess forward slash and page 2 dot html quotation mark angle brackets and our link text which is page 2 and then we end the a tag like that file save now we want to link back from uh, page 2 to index and the code to link back to a file in a directory above the directory which the current file is located from uh, chess to my website is dot dot slash and each time you want to move up a level in the folder hierarchy you must type two periods and a forward slash so in our case we already have index.html here which is what we used for page one now we want dot dot 
slash and that should bring us up to the index file in my website file save so let's take a look and see if it works index and here we have page 2 which is in the chess folder and we have linked back to the index page and let's uh, tidy up the code a little bit here let's copy this and place it right here file save let's double click index you have page 1 back to index page 2 in the chess folder and back to index and that concludes uh, this tutorial uh, one thing I might add is that uh, I'm using index and page 1 and page 2 as uh, examples so it's easier to uh, follow along but of course uh, use a relevant title to your pages okay that's it for this time and uh, in our next tutorial we will take a look at uh, how to make links inside one page like they do in frequently asked question pages for example